Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 Ultra and in this video I am going to show you how you can use Microsoft Office for free in this tablet. So guys, the office that I am talking about is the web based version. So first of all, you have to open your internet browser. So I will open this Samsung internet browser and once you open it, you have to change one setting. First of all, you have to go over here, these three lines, just select it. Once you select it, here you see there is a settings icon, just select it. Once you select it, here you see this option of web page view and scrolling, just select it. Once you select it, at the very last, you see this option of request desktop sites. So it is disabled, so you have to enable it. Okay, so this is the first setting. Now you have to go back. Okay, and now you have to open a website. Name of the website is office.com. Okay, so I will open this website office.com. Okay, and then I will select this go option. So guys, this is an official Microsoft website for Microsoft Office. Okay, so once you open it, then what you have to do, you have to select this sign in option. Okay, so I just select it. Okay, once you select it, it will take you to the sign in page where you have to enter your Microsoft account. If you don't have the account, you can create a new account by selecting this option of create one. So I already have my Microsoft account. I will enter my account. So I sign in with my Microsoft account account and here you see this is your dashboard for your office so here if you select these dots over here so if i just select it here you have all your apps so you can see you have this excel you have word you also have the powerpoint so now let's open the microsoft word so i just select it it will open in a new tab over here so here you can see so this is your dashboard for microsoft word so here you have different templates available i select the new blank document okay so once you select it it will show you all the Microsoft Word tools okay so I will show you how does it look like so here you can see all your tools are available okay so you have insert layout reference review view all your uh, tools are available so now for example if I want to type something I can type here so you can see I can do all my work the next thing that I want to mention here is this free version of office it is giving you 5 GB of cloud storage so all your work will be saved into Microsoft OneDrive so here you can see it is showing you saved to OneDrive OneDrive. You can also access your OneDrive through the same Microsoft Office dashboard. So here if you just select this Office dashboard, select these dots. Okay. And here you can see this is your OneDrive. You can just select it and see your work. Okay, so now let's come back to the word here. You can see all your tools are available. You can share your work. So all the font option, the color option, the highlighting option, everything is available. Once you finish your work, you can download a copy of your work. So I just select this file. Okay, and then I select this save as option and here you can see you can download a copy you can download as PDF or you can download as ODT. Now let's open the Microsoft Excel. So I go back to this office.com uh, and here I will select this Excel. Okay, so once you select it, it will open the Microsoft Excel. So here is the Microsoft Excel dashboard. So here you have all your templates and here is my previous work that is saved in Microsoft OneDrive. So now I will open my previous work. Okay, so I will open uh, this Microsoft Excel sheet and here it will show you all your tools. So here you can see you have all your tools available, insert, draw, page layout the most important is formula so you have your formulas okay so here is my previous work so let's say I want to use this formula tab I just select it and here you can see all the formulas are showing okay so for example I select this sum so sum average count numbers then if I select this 
uh, accounting so this is for the accounting then we have other formulas so you can use all your formulas the next thing that i want to show you is this insert tab so here you have uh, your pivot table you have uh, your table option uh, for pictures you can also create different kind of graphs so here is the graph tools okay you can add text box so all the options are available over here now the next thing is this draw tab if you just select it then you can use your s pen to draw anything so for example i select this pen okay and then i can write here anything with my s pen okay so here you can see this is how it looks like if you want you can also use this highlighter if you want to highlight something on your excel work now let's open the microsoft powerpoint so i go back to this microsoft office i select these dots and here is the powerpoint so i just select this powerpoint it will open the powerpoint and here you have different templates available and here is your previous work it is showing that uh, already save so now i will open uh, this presentation okay and here here in the PowerPoint, you have all your tools available. You can create different uh, design, all the templates. Okay, so here you can see we have this home tab, insert, draw, design, and then we have transition animation slideshow all the tools are available for powerpoint the next thing i want to mention here is if you select this present option okay and then you can use your s pen as a laser pointer okay so if you select this pen option from here you have different option like laser pointer pen highlighter for example i select this laser pointer then you can point out anything in your presentation okay so for example if i want to highlight something i can do it like this okay so i go to the next slide from here so here if you want to point out something you can point out using your s pen in the powerpoint you also have this uh, draw option you can use this draw option if you want to use your s pen to write anything so here you can see i can write on my powerpoint slides as well so here you can see all your tools are available then if you select the slideshow option we have the slideshow if you go to the insert tab we have shapes a stock images smart art text box all the uh, powerpoint tools are available the next thing that i want to mention here is you can open your work in the split screen mode so for example i have this powerpoint i just press and hold this tab and i open in other window so here is the option of open in other window once i select it it will open this powerpoint in a split screen mode in a different window so here is my powerpoint work okay and then here on the other side i can open excel okay so here you can see i can open two different apps the next thing is you can open any other app as well so for example i select this edge panel and here for example i have this samsung notes i can just bring it here in the split screen okay so here is my samsung notes here is my powerpoint and here on the other side i have my excel work i can also rotate them so if you want to change their position so you can change them as well so you can work on different apps at the same time so guys this is for today's video i hope you like the video i hope you enjoy the video so please subscribe to my channel thank you very much